Yet now hear, O Jacob, my servant. Be a Jacob children, Jacob our children. And Israel, whom I have chosen. And who? And Israel, whom I have chosen. That's why we are the Israelites, and we the Lord chosen. Yeah, but here we know, sister. We can't just take it up by ourselves and say we're going back. Because you see the military might when they move over there. You know, see every minute them fling stone and boom and drop. So we can't go over there and say we're going to take back. We have to wait for the heavenly father who are doing. Give me that. Give me that then I'm uh, going. Yeah. Give me the, give me, this is how we are going to go. But me the father. Give me the book of First Thessalonians chapter uh, 4 and start at 16. Chapter 4, verse 16. For the Lord himself shall descend from heaven with a shout, with the voice of the archangel, and with the trump of God. And the dead in Christ shall rise first. So the dead in Christ, these are the martyr who die in the name of the heavenly Father. When I read the book of Revelation, chapter 6, verse 9, it tell you about the white robes. Read. When we which are alive and remain shall be put up together with them. We which still on the earth who are alive, when I'm dead yet, we, the, the dead person of God, and then we are going to read our own feet and go to read that. In the clouds, to meet the Lord in the air, and so shall we ever be with the Lord. So when it's with the clouds, they are absent. You see, they call them spearship. About chariots. Well, I'm not a spirit champion. I'm not a spirit champion. I'm not a spirit champion. I'm not a i yeah, Jesus answered, Verily, verily, I say unto thee, Except a man be born of water and of the Spirit, he cannot enter into the kingdom of God. Is that where you are? No, this is how we uh, get back our understanding. Give me the book of uh, Ephesians, chapter 5, verse 26. Ephesians 5 and 26, that he might sanctify and cleanse it with the washing of the water by the word. So you see, when it says, if any man, read John 3, John 3 and 5. John 3 and verse 5. Yahweh I answered, verily, verily, I say unto thee. So it says, surely, surely, I say unto thee, read. Except a man be born of water. Except a man be born of water. That means this words, read. And of the spirit. The spirit where you get the Holy Ghost. You read in John chapter um, what, 15, verse 26. Read. He cannot enter into the kingdom of Yahweh because he will clean up himself and come to the heavenly Father in a righteousness. You understand? Because when give me the book of um, First Corinthians, Second Corinthians, chapter six and um, six, six and uh, get First Corinthians chapter six. But the Lord of hosts shall be exalted in judgment, and Yahweh that is all holy shall be sanctified in righteousness. Okay, you said it was Yahweh. Where is that? No, Yahweh is not in there. It's God. But you see what happened? Because this is Hebrew for God. God is just a title. No, Yahweh means He exists. That's why I said, I am that I am. Okay, you say Yahweh, you say Yahweh. Well, you see, now you, you're in a Hebrew. You understand? Because at the end of the day, Yahweh. Right? And Yahweh just means he exists. And Yahweh means he comes to deliver. Right? 
So this is what we call Jesus, but we say you're our child. We're fine. I need to go now. Then shall the land be off to them. Well, we're now going to hear your sister, but every week we never want to see this one. Not every week we don't want to see this one because, you see, the authority that we do not want us to know the truth. But the truth is what can set our people free. But them don't want to get the truth, they want to get the life. Because the Christian church, the sister, I'm going to ask you a simple question. Who gives the pastor them license? Yes. Do you know, sir, if a pastor is going to be a pastor in a church, he has to do a certified to be a pastor. So who gave him in the license? None of these men in the book has no certified license. Yes, we know that, sister. It, it's in the book. But the thing is this, we are not certified. Oh, we get the knowledge. No, not anyone, sister, because the pastor them are for 500 years. Or people them been singing songs and not taught the Bible. So we have to taught the Bible word for word, what the Heavenly Father said. So people them can wake up and come out of them dead state of mind. Because our people them think that they're safe. Safe from what? The Lord said, each, he that is saved, give, give it a give. One right, he that can go to the end. Jeremiah 23 and 1. Woe be unto the pastors. You know what woe mean? Wait me. Destruction. Read. Woe be unto the pastors that destroy and scatter the sheep of my pasture, saith the Lord. Therefore, thus saith the Lord God of Israel against the pastors that feed my people. Ye have scattered my flock and have driven them away. Oh, them do that. Church of God. You have shepherd and you have pastor. I see the King James. So basically, you have shepherd, you have pastor, and same thing. You understand? What the heck? We are Jeremiah 3. Jeremiah 3. Right? Right, right. You see, we are going to scripture here. We are going to go scripture here. But yo, sister. Yeah, man. Push up. The fat one, read on. Woo unto them that draw iniquity with cords of vanity yes. and sins as it Solid. were in the yeah. heart. One minute, one minute, one minute. Hebrew is a lie. Yes. The tribe of, 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 of Yoruba. Yoruba. Yes. Okay. <laughs> so, where your wife? Where's your wife from? Yeah, where from? This is the tribe of, 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 of the mixed materiality. We are raped by the descendant of the white man and the Caribbean woman. No, no, no. Where are you from? Black woman, I say. 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 He's an English guy. Yes. Okay, so called white man. Okay, well. You can get to the children with that. You can get to the children with that. Guys. Come on, man. It's that strong. Yo, listen, man. Take care of yourself. All right, cool. That's my day. Yeah, you see Benjamin, Benjamin. Well, woke up in a Benjamin, ready in a Right? Yo, we wish the people have come to the right of path. Walk on, Kate. Hello, sister. One minute at a time. You have the beautiful Bible. You believe that Bible? What's our people? 
nor a sodomite of the sons of Israel. Now who? No, nor a sodomite of the sons of Israel. So none of our son not to come on here and turn no MBG to A M G H E. That's not in our portfolio. Leave the other people and make them do it. Because they are not of the Lord. They are the devil. Now give me the book of first John, chapter 3, and start at um, 10. Are you doing Esau? Why are you spouting that anti-gay rubbish around here? We are reading the Bible so you can kiss it. Listen boy. We are reading the Bible man so you can jump in items. That's what? No, slavery done enough. Over 400 years and counting gone. A whole time now. So go chuck off the items. Right. John chapter 3 and verse 10. And in this, the children of God are manifest and the children of the devil. So you see, you are the children of God because you come to the word of the Lord. And you see where the children of the devil say? They're against it. Yes. It's so the spirit work. They're against what we are saying. So you know, say, they are the children of wickedness. Right? Give me the book of um, James, right? Say, uh, don't be at the world. And give me the book of John, chapter um, 14, verse 15. persecute you. you see that so we don't come out here and go on like we are untouchable they're going to persecute us man but we're ready man if the lord come here and dead for us we have the dead for him come man right read if they have kept my saying they will have kept yours also but all these things will they do unto you for my name's sake all these things they will do unto us for his name's sake, man. Right? So we there with the word of the Lord, man. Powerful. You see that? Because they know not him that sent me. They know not the heavenly father that sent Yahweh Shai. Because if they knew the heavenly father that knew sent Yahweh Shai, they would have listened. And they would have known that they are part of his great. They are part of creation, but they are not a part of his chosen. Because he created everyone, but he chose who he loved and said, come and stay by me. Right? So that's why they hate us. 
and then we ate us because what? And the Lord chose us and then we chose to go to the Lord. And he chose us. And you're a special little princess. Right? We're going to read some scripture here. Read where you are. This is First John chapter 2 and verse 15. Love not the world, even the things are in the world. If any man love the world, the love of the Father is not in him. Okay, say, if we come and say we love this world, oh, this place is so nice. I love everything what they teach me. The love of the Father not to you, man. Right? Because look, you look at that dark group, the man tell us she can go all up on the next lady hand and gone all over the place. Oh, they are right, they're just having fun. Leave them alone. No, who oh, are when my little daughter grew up and turned a woman, becomes the grandchildren. So the lineage keep going on. That's what the heavenly father tell you to people. What use? So if she can't take up one girl now, where's my grandchildren coming from? They're not coming nowhere. So that is dead, man. So we don't depend on what the Lord said. Read that. For all that is in the world, the lust of the flesh and the lust of the eyes and the pride of life is not of the Father, but it's of the world. You see that? Be of lust. You see the woman that walk up and down out there and next to nothing. Man see them a lust. Man see man a walk and a lust of a man. Woman see woman a walk and a lust of a woman. All kind of madness to one another place, man. Right? So you can't love this place, man. The love of the Father cannot be in you if you love this place. So we love our people and we are telling them, say, come out of this foolish because it's death and destruction, man. Right? We do have. Jeremiah chapter 6 and verse 2. I have likened the daughter of Zion to a comely and delicate woman. The Lord said, You are beautiful and you're comely, right? That means you're beautiful and you're delicate. So at the end of the day, you need protection. Your father, right now you're young, your father your protection. So when your father calls you and says, did you clean up your room? Make sure you clean. You understand? <laughs> so you can't get a reward. You understand? So anything nice, you don't know your father going to look out for you. and make everything go good for you. Right? Give me the book of Ecclesiastes chapter 12 and start that one. Right? Because we have to show people that say, there is hope for us. Right? First, first chapter, chapter 2, let's start that one. This is Ecclesiastes chapter 12 verse 1. Remember now thy creator in the days of thy youth. So right now you're young. So you have to remember the heavenly father there, you. Because know you know your youth. And know you come like a sponge, you're ready to learn. And you're going to suck up things and you're going to maintain where you learn. So you maintain in a this way of life when you want to teach you, you're going to keep it and you're going to keep it doing fully, fully. You don't want that. You want to do what's right in the eyes of our Father. Right? That's it, Daniel. This is book of 1st John, chapter 2 and verse 1. My little children, these things write I unto you, that ye sin not. What did that say? That ye sin not. So you see? The Lord said we love to sin. You understand? And all you have to do is say you love to sin. You have to read the scripture to know what is sin. Read that. And if any man sin, we have an advocate with the Father, Jesus Christ, the righteous. You see, we love to sin. Once you start sin, the heavenly Father are going to be against us. You understand? So once you keep ourselves on the righteous path, we are going to be on the righteous path in our Father. He might go look after us. He might go make us get prosperity. Read that. Verse 2. And he is the propitiation for our sins. And not for ours only, but also for the sins of the whole world. For the sins of the whole earth, world, man. And that I represent the children of Israel. Because we the children of Israel, we are a world and to the heavenly father himself, right? Because at the end of the day, one person can sin, and through one person sin, it causes destruction and the whole of our family, right? So we have to make sure, sir, we're mindful of the heavenly father, and we do this, we do, this is sin, you know what is sin? 
Let us see. Right, right, right. But anything that ain't right in the eyes of God. But we have to understand what is sin by the Bible so we can know how to keep away from sin. Read this. First John chapter 3 and verse 4. These who have committed sin transgress the force of the law. For sin is the transgression of the law. What did Lord say? Sin is the transgression of the law. So sin is when we break God's law. Say so we walk down the road and box down a boy. Me not sin. Me just box him down kind of disrespect. And he may be a glass him for my life. Right? So me have to fix him up. Me not sin. You just carry the dude here, my father. Me buy now. He'll be cut off all of your head. Him sin? No. It was hard in by the Lord for him to cut off his head. Our sister Judith cut off all the his head. She never sin. No. I got me sure you say, when we sin, I want to break God's law. Yes, when you have your beard and your shave off it, you are sin. Because the Lord said, we keep you. Uh, you understand? And the Lord said, oh, our beautiful daughters, now for me, the chosen. So make you look good, daughter, one second. I need to buy you some nice dress so you look immaculate for the Lord and faithful. All our household. You understand? Oh, we are here. Where are you? Uh, Elia. Elia. Yeah. Nice to meet you. Where are you? Keep the channel. Keep the channel. Elia, you have a phone? You have a phone? Keep the channel. Elia, you have a phone? Keep the channel. Elia, you have a phone? Keep the channel.
So in the Siddiqs? No, we speak different language. Okay, what about the Siddiqs? You know the Siddiqs? Ah. They worship the human beings. The Siddiqs? They pray to a human sadhu, somebody. Six and Shiva. Yeah, they, they so pray who you to the idol. I pray to the living God, Jehovah God. The God of Abraham, Isaac and Jacob. Okay, Okay, so basically, if you pray for the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, Amen. you'll be able to be an Israelite. Yeah, I, I pray for this Israel, God bless Israel, bless them, and let them be in peace and God. Which Israel? Protect, protect Israel. God is saying, pray for Israel. Right, so the Israel over there in the in um, Israel right now, those yeah. are the Israel you pray for? You can't pray for the land. Israel is a people. A people, yes. yes right. That's right. Yes. So the people, the land over there called Israel right now, that is not the real Israel. Yeah, yeah. No, Israel is a people. Yes. So you have to pray for the people. people yes. Right? Yes. And we are the children of Israel. Amen. We've been dispersed. Amen. No, the reason why we've been dispersed, yeah. let me read something to you. Because give me the book of uh, yeah. James chapter 4 and start at 1. James 4 verse 1. And give me the book of Romans chapter 8 verse 16. Give me that. Anyone on the front? Yeah. Listen to this. Can you make your Israelite? Yeah. I know he's coming. Jesus is coming. James chapter 4 and verse 1. From whence come wars. <laughs> Romans chapter 8 and verse 16. 